Welcome back to another episode of MotoGP Mac, and today we're going to talk about some of the riders being asked their opinion on what direction to go for the 2027 regulations. Now, speaking recently, Marquez said, it depends if you want to have a MotoGP category for the show or to find the perfect bike. I personally prefer the show. If you take out some of the aerodynamics, if you take out some of the ride height and all of these things, I believe for the show, it will be much, much better because now it is more difficult to overtake than in the past. Now, a perfect bike means going more with aerodynamics, which leads to the lap times being faster. But people at home don't realize if riders are going one second faster or slower from the TV screen. So I would say it this way less aerodynamics, everything more manual, and the show will get better. Now, Jack Miller was also asked in this, and he said, we ride the best bikes in the world. If they're 850cc or 1200cc, we're going to ride them. We are going pretty fast right now. Even with my fat ass on the bike, we're still able to do 360 kilometers an hour in Qatar. We keep getting this issue and the tracks are getting smaller and smaller because the speed is getting higher. 360 isn't ideal, but this is the pinnacle of motor racing. They have been to 800 cc before and they ended up coming back to 1000 cc. But change is good as it allows some manufacturers a fresh start. And I can think of a few that would like them. Also, Maverick Vinales was asked, and he said, I am not a technician. I never rode an 800 in the past, and 2027 is too far away. Maybe they can find more power, I don't know. But, of course, if they take out aero, you cannot push the same amount of power going out of the corners. So you probably cannot reach the same top speeds. So if, it's for, so if the purpose is for safety the bikes would maybe have less top speed. But I don't know if it's going to be more fun for the rider or not, because change is always something that can be a challenge. Now, I don't disagree with any of them here. I think I think what it's screaming for is that the regulations are right within it, but I do believe, and I think it's really good, that all the riders have kind of differing opinions on what it is. So when you look at it for fans as well, Every fan is definitely going to have a difference of opinion on what they should do. Um, but again, I don't really think the the change is going to hurt the sport. Uh, it might hurt some manufacturers that already have advantage. I do think it's funny what Jack said about you know, allowing some manufacturers a fresh start. I don't think he's ever spoken a more truer word. But I would definitely love to know your thoughts. What do you think of all three riders' comments on the 2027 regulations? Definitely leave your thoughts in the comments below. And I'll be back again tomorrow with another video.